Well, I saw Top Gun Maverick. It was my most anticipated film of the summer. Hit all the marks. Just want to manage the expectations. It was the tr truly, truly refreshing summer blockbuster of the year. It, it, it literally is a breath of fresh air. Like I haven't seen a movie like this and I'm kind of getting, you know, after watching this movie, I'm starting to feel like, man, I'm, my appetite for like Marvel movies is, <laughs> and like other superhero movies, DC and Marvel movies and things of the like, it's just not the same. Cause I'm like, you know what, if we can get this kind of a movie and it can have that kind of a budget that, you know, those superhero movies have, and it can be this good and this refreshing and this much fun, like, you, you know, why, why do we get more of this? That, that's, that was my biggest takeaway from this movie. Tom Cruise delivers in the scenes with Miles Teller, Jennifer Connelly, like, you know, you got Rooster in there. It is better than the original in almost every way you can imagine. It, it, it is honestly, like I said, one of the best movies you're gonna watch this year. It is probably the best thing Tom Cruise has done in a while and his Mission Impossible movies are pretty good, but I gotta be honest, this, it hit me right in the feels. I mean, for an aviation nerd, it's like a wet dream and it, you're, you're gonna be sitting there and all, oh, your jaw's gonna drop a few times. I mean, look, this film, I, I'm right right now, I'll just, I'll just say this. It is the best film about aviation that has ever been made. It literally is. There's nothing that comes close. And I, you know, I was lost for words at times. I watched a lot of the promo material going into it. I'm pretty sure they said that almost every sequence in the movie that you see where there's a fighter jet involved, it's all real. And there's very little CGI used across the board. It honors the original. It brings back Iceman. So you have Val Kilmer in there. And the, the sequence with him and Tom Cruise, it's that's some of the most emotional heart-wrenching stuff in in the in the entire movie there's a story in the dynamic between tom cruise's you know pete maverick mitchell and miles teller's goose it, it's, it's a very interesting dynamic and it and it really functions as like the emotional uh spine of the movie and and it's fantastic the, the, the way the whole story plays out it's it's perfect um it flies by honestly and and you know pun totally intended um, the two-hour runtime, you never feel it. It, 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 it. it, you know, goes by in an instant, and and the story flows really well, even when it slows down. And yet, those character moments, they're poignant. They're, this movie has heart. This movie has gravitas, it, and and some really good, freaking, awesome action. Some of the stuff that I saw, you know, fighter just do in this movie, I'm like, wow. I, and as an aviation nerd, I'm like, I didn't know they could do some of these things. And they, they tell you in the featurettes for behind the scenes stuff, that if, you can go see that on YouTube now, that literally every maneuver that a fighter jet does in this movie, they did that in for real. Regardless of whether they, you know, uh, in the very few instances they replaced it with a CGI model or whatever, or most of the time you see the actual jet, you know, they shot the real fighter jets doing these maneuvers. and. There's some just jaw-dropping stuff in this film. I, I would, I would say Top Gun Maverick, five stars. Go see it now.